Look at this box. This must be the biggest box I ever got in the mail. And I know what it is. I hope you enjoyed this little sequence I did with my wife. Let's talk about the pros and cons or the things I like and dislike of this bike. Let's start right away with the things I dislike because there is not many of them. Actually there is just two things. First thing I would change is the fact that I'm living in France, Europe and uh, European regulations are quite uh, firm. It means no battery over 250 watt. Max speed is uh, 25 km per hour and the uh, throttle is only a help to get you to 6 km then you have to take over with the pedal assist. It's fun anyway but I guess if you're living in the US or somewhere else where the regulations are not that strict you can have even more fun. And the second thing, something actually that I like but at the same time I dislike is the kickstand. It's a really nice kickstand as you can see it's stable, it's not going anywhere. Only thing I will change is the fact that when you get down from the stand, it kicks back pretty hard. That's it about the things I dislike because actually this bike is awesome. I mean, look at this. The look is really awesome. I like the color, I love the fat tires, they are just awesome. It gives you a special look and uh, because there is no suspension on this bike, even a little bump or hole in the road, you won't feel it as bad as you would if you didn't have these fat tires. What else do I love? I love the fact that the battery is removable, so it means when you come home, you can just take the battery off, take it with you home, charge it overnight, come back the next day, put it back on the bike and you're ready to go. So that's a nice feature. This seat, this is actually the passenger pack, it doesn't come with the bike and it's really cool because you can ride with another person. I rode it with my wife behind me, I ride it with the kids. It's a, a nice comfort seat for the person sitting behind you or if you want you can sit just fur further away and sit in this position. I'm a big guy, I'm almost 2 meters and 100 kilos for, so for me it's a little bit too low and not that comfortable. So when I'm riding the bike, I have to lift up the seat, which is for me then a great position to ride. You have a front light, you have a brake light, which is great when someone's running behind you. As soon as you brake, the light goes on. A nice feature, there is also a small bell uh, built in the brakes. You really have to look carefully to see it, but it's a nice feature to have. Generally the look it gives you when you're riding, I see many people turning their heads. I just want to say thanks again to the folks over at Rad Power Bike for sponsoring this video, for letting me get my hands on this awesome bike. I really love it. I will put in the description below the link to the website of uh, Rad Power Bikes. They have many other products but this one, the Rad Runner, comes in Europe at uh, 1199 euros. If you have any questions, you want to ask me something about the bike, write me down in the comments. I will answer them uh, as well as I can. If not, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments how did you like this video. For now, that's it and I guess I see you in the next one. Peace!